Hello dear friends, hope you're having a great day. Today we're here with a short tutorial video to review one of the practical techniques in Clothe 3 d or Marvelous Designer. With this technique, you can add attractive details to your clothing. In this video, we aim to create logos or embossed prints on garments. For this, you need transparent images or ones in PNG format. If you've downloaded ready-made ones, they're usable. Otherwise, you can edit your images using Photoshop. For example, I want to place this bird design as an embossed print on the front of this crop top. Use images with good resolution in a solid colored background. Use the select menu and choose color range. Select the background and press the delete key on your keyboard. Now save the image as a PNG file. Let's return to the Clothe3D software. Click on the graphics option, select it, then choose your image. These dashed lines are your guides for placing the design. Click on the garment. A window named Add Graphic will appear. This allows you to adjust the size and position of your design. Also, using the option Transform Graphic, you can again adjust placement or scale at this stage. I'll take a preview render of it, so we can see how it looks on the- The result looks fine. It, it's acceptable, but the print looks flat. Let's go back to the 2D section. Click on the graphic again. In the Property Editor section, there's an option called Print Type. Based on the type you select here, you can control how the print is displayed on the garment. It changes the look. You can adjust the texture, the depth, and similar property. You can even convert it into a flat solid surface. Now I want to add some embossing to this design. For that, you'll need to add a new map under display. Let's go back to Photoshop. In the first step, convert the to black and white. In Clothe 3D, areas of the image that are white will appear raised. So for this image, you need to invert the design and use the Ctrl plus I shortcut to invert the colors. Now the background is use the Ctrl plus I shortcut on your keyboard to invert the colors. Now the background has turned black. In the image section, use the option Levels. Under Imprig Levels, you can adjust the black and white balance to refine the image. Now we've got an acceptable result. I'll confirm it. And now we need to remove the background. Again, use the Select Right Pointing Arrow Pick the Background Color and press Delete. Then again, save the image as PN. We'll save it again. Now let's return to the Clothe 3D software. In the Property Editor section, under Displacement Map, we'll add the new design. When we enter Render Mode, in the Amount section, we input a value, and the design will appear embossed. As you can see in this technique, you can also use a normal map to give your design a textured, embroidered-like appearance. For example, I'll assign this map to it. As you can see in the 3D view, it's visible too. And in the Transformation section, I'll reduce the texture scale a little. Now it looks exactly like an embroidery stitch. You can even see the fabric text on the design. I hope you found this tutorial interesting and useful. Follow us for more upcoming tutorials. Thank you for staying with us. Goodbye.